So guys, you may be in the market for a new monitor. I currently have two which are very similar. They're both Acer's 27 inch. And I'm now gonna be trialing a curved screen. Now you may be going from one monitor and thinking I'm gonna go for two, but you might want to watch this first of all. The fact that I've had the two screens has been great in some respects, but the stand was annoying, the center bezel, the fact that there's a join down the middle, um, you know, on a Mac they work really well independently as monitors, but using one wide area has been frustrating. So I've decided that I'm going to go for a curved screen, an ultra wide screen, just to see what the differences are and to see whether it's worth it. So folks, I've swapped these two 27 inch Acer's for this Samsung 34 inch CF791. My initial impressions are, oh my God absolutely stunning to look at the picture quality the step up in resolution going from 1080p to not quite 4k guys but this is 3440 by 1440 and it's absolutely beautiful the curvature on the screen is something which I didn't think would make much of a difference but it doesn't actually matter whether you're watching a TV show a movie or if you're actually just doing productivity like editing or Photoshop it it does draw you in more it makes it more immersive and I don't know why but you end up looking at different corners of the screen thinking all oh, right look at that up there look at that down there it is absolutely incredible folks so when I'm editing videos this is Final Cut Pro it works brilliantly look at the length of that timeline across the bottom so if you are a content creator and you are using video editing software you will absolutely love going for a screen like this which is ultra wide there's obviously going to be some drawbacks not having the independence of the second screen but for anything that you're doing in terms of editing so here for instance in Lightroom editing photographs again brilliant you can see it so clearly and I definitely found that it was an improvement to what I had previously so guys what I'm not saying that this monitor is the one that you should go for I will do a review on this monitor which is the Samsung and you know my initial thoughts are great it looks amazing but I will do an honest review whether this is one that you ought to consider in the next couple of weeks I've literally had this for a few days and so this is just my first thoughts on going from two quite large monitors 27 inches going down to one all, all but being 34 inches but guys the biggest factor I would say that if you do use your computer monitor for watching TV shows or movies or playing games then wow just incredible this is Battlefield 1 it's 21 9 screen ratio and that is absolutely perfect for gameplay guys so you'll absolutely be drawn right into the center of the action if you have got a screen like this but it really is as I said before it's gameplay it's TV shows it's movies where it comes into its own so guys I'm not gonna witter on all day about it my initial impressions are that I really really love what I've got so far it's not inexpensive it is a quite an expensive monitor this was um, 750 pounds which is about I think they're about nine hundred dollars in the US I will leave the links in the description so you can check it out for yourselves but if you are in the market for either going for a second screen or you're looking at getting rid of two screens and going ultra wide then definitely this is one that is worth considering folks but I will do a full review in the next couple of weeks but thanks for watching this video as always if it, you like it give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe <laughs>